Hi, I'm Sean Gannon, and this is Minute Math. And today we're going to learn about adding and subtracting polynomials, and we're going to simplify each expression. So if I was given this expression, 8k plus k squared minus 6, parentheses minus, other parentheses, negative 10k plus 7 minus 2k to the second power. Okay? Well, first thing I want to do here is uh, I look at both parentheses. Are there like terms? No, there's not. So then I make all my subtractions with the adding a negative. So I have 8k plus, excuse me, k squared. And then minus 6 is adding a negative 6. Then I'm also going to distribute this minus sign across. Negative, negative gives me a positive, uh, plus a positive 10k here. And we have plus a negative 7 here by distributing the subtraction sign. And then plus a positive 2k to the second power. Okay. Now I'm going to rewrite. Uh, this using the commutative property with the highest degrees first and my like terms together. So I have k squared here. So I dot, should I brought it down, plus 2k squared. Don't hit the switch on. Then from there, I don't have anything else in the second power. So the first power of 8k. And then plus a 10k. Now I keep going. I have a, uh, nothing else with k's, but I have my constants plus a negative 6 and plus a negative 7. Right there. So now I brought my like terms together. Fantastic. All right, they're next to each other. So now let's go simplify. Let's combine them. K squared plus 2K squared is 3K squared. 8K plus 10K is 18K. And negative 6 plus a negative 7 is a negative 13. Negative 13. So let's go minus 13. And there we have it. We have our final answer here, which is 3K squared plus 18K minus 13. So let's recap. We're given 8K plus K squared minus 6. And then uh, and roll in parentheses and subtract the parentheses, negative 10k plus 7 minus 2k squared. I made everything to be at a negative. I find that easier and distributed the subtraction sign. And then that gave me 8k plus k squared plus a negative 6 plus positive 10k plus a negative 7 plus a positive 2k squared. Then I rewrote this using the commutative property, having my highest degrees first and my like terms together. So we have k squared plus 2k squared plus 8k plus 10k plus negative 6 plus a negative 7. And I use a dot method when I brought it down and triple check by uh, seeing if everything matched up and it did. Everything was brought down. Then I simplified and combined my like terms, giving me a 3k squared plus 18k minus 13 as my final answer.